hello everyone. My name is not just Master Starman. My name is Master Starman, along with Dawn. I have to admit, this was not possible without her. It was not possible without her amazing team of Pokemon. That got me this far. It was not without my amazing team that really has gotten me this far. Now, I'm going to make a last minute decision that I didn't do in my last attempt that might have cost me. I'm going to be using some rare candies to level some of my Pokemon up a tiny bit more, just so that they stand a bit more of a chance. I should not do this this year, but yeah. I'm going to be trying to get some of my Pokemon up a little bit higher. Um. Okay, then. At least... Most of my team up to level 50, some of my, some of my main ones that I want to get on 52, if anything, because at least there. Um, okay, that's pretty good there. And the swine on 50. Actually, I'm gonna and I'm gonna use this last one. You think I kind of want to use it on Pachirisu just because is gonna be a main star in this fight. It's, Hers is to believe, and I'm also going to be using a ether on Krilava's eruption here because that attack could also come in a major handy here. Okay, I also got to admit, Krilava screwed me over in a previous attempt, which I'm not, gonna, which I'm going to show up when it comes up. Okay, I got to also admit though. This battle is friggin' awesome. I have no words on it, other than that, it speaks for itself. Cynthia is probably one of the best champions of the series, in my honest opinion. A million times better than N. Um, I, I don't know, really. I'm not going back into random discussions here. Okay, um, I gotta also go back and also say, though, I admittedly... I had a very, very mixed opinion on this Let's Play, as hard as it is for you guys to believe at this point, but I loved this Let's Play. I loved working on this Let's Play, and I admit one thing, I do not want, I do not want this Let's Play to end. I am actually admitting that right now. I think that this Let's Play was so fun that I admittedly don't want it to end, as hard as it is to believe it. Come the hell on! Are you really being this big of a noob this early on? I'd like it if this could burn immediately so that it could prove how bad of a decision that was to do. Critical. Wait, that was not a critical hit, really? Uh, I might as well go out with a bang here if I can. Yeah, actually, oh wait, no, this won't KO, actually. If it was, if it keeps its 150 base power in mo Oh, wow. Wow, that did a lot. This, if this gets a critical though, Flava would end up taking out Garchomp, and if that happens, that's gonna be friggin' hilarious. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, that is actually pretty friggin' funny. Um, yeah, okay, it's gonna be entirely random what she sends out here, so I might want something that's all around good. So I'm gonna try Mammoth Swine actually. But <laughs> um bad, 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 bad matchup. I should have probably known that was coming up. You know what? I'm actually gonna try something a bit strange. I'm gonna try Stealth Rock here. I have not shown this move off yet, and I wanted to. It's been on my moveset for ages now, and I have not used I have not used it a single time, and it looks like I'm not gonna land a single decent punch. Okay, well, oh shoot, Kalava's gone now, that's kind of a problem at this point. Okay, well, anyways, what I was gonna say was, personally, I had a lot of fun doing this Let's Play, and that paralysis is really, really effective, but I really, really had a lot of fun doing this Let's Play, and I'm kind of admitting it here, I'm admittedly pretty sad to see it go, because... I don't know if you, a lot of you guys noticed it or not, but this Let's Play was... was the entire time. I can't believe I never mentioned this before. 
But this Let's Play is a tribute. It's a tribute to... Quite possibly... No, literally, a tribute to my favorite pro One of my favorite video game heroes, female protagonists, Pokemon protagonists, um... Pokemon characters in general, and so many other things that I can think of. And this uh, entire Let's Play is a trip. Come on, game! Really? No! Now she's just gonna heal that! Why is Air Slash been sucking at me so much? Ah, recovering someone. I gotta well, honestly admit, though. Oh, oh my god, she didn't. Oh my god, she didn't. <laughs> I admittedly have to say, though, this entire Let's Play was in dedication to Dawn. I don't know if I've ever mentioned that or not. I did mention it, not in very great detail, but I literally have to admit it takes a lot of guts to do something like this. For one, not just in the fact that you're doing an insane challenge in a Pokemon game, for one. I mean a really insane challenge, like... Really, really... Something you would not think of doing, for one. Second, just... Like... I don't even know where I'm going with this. This is really being one insane let's play, you have to admit that. Literally, I've gone through... Oh, excuse me, so much, like... So much hard shit by doing, like... Wait, oh wow, that's really powerful, actually. I've gone through a lot of stuff in this let's play. And... I honestly had plenty of great moments in it, too. And on top of that, I thought my commentary was strangely good for how it usually stands out. And I have not had a Let's Play that's been arguably as fun as this one was in so long. And I've really admittedly missed having a good challenge like this. And on top of that, it's been definitely one of my longest Let's Plays that's been in the making. I got this idea roughly around a year ago to do this Let's Play. And I am looking on a year later on it, recording the finale of it might I also add. I had a lot of fun doing recording this entire Let's Play. There's been so many great moments in it. And so many great things that have happened too. Like. Uh, I, I'm not really sure. Right now, it looks like I've gotten into a pretty bad spot, though. Seriously, all I'm down into is Pachiri soon. I think Orskir is 20 PP, which means that I'm gonna have to stall for a while now. Um... I'm not sure what it'll use against Pachiri here, unless it... Unless, like, ZMP said, it has Hidden Power Ground, but I doubt that it'll have that. No, it's just going to continue using Aura Sphere. Okay, well, that's not too bad. Although, that could be a problem, because I don't have that much time left in my film here. Um, yeah, I might have to, like I did with, uh, Flint, stop the recording part way through a little bit. Um... I don't know if I could take an Aura Sphere normally. I really don't. Um... Let's see what my own Toe can do, actually. Or Scare never ever misses either, which is the problem. Oh wait, I might be able to actually take this hit. Hold on, please, please, please. Dang it! Okay, how come your or Air Slash would've did so much extra damage? And mine was pretty much shit and bricks on me the last, like, few attempts at this. Okay, I really don't know what I can do here. It's gonna just use Shockwave on me, I know that for a fact. Yep, and Shockwave never misses either, that's... Why would it have two attacks like this? It reminds me of, uh, 
this one trainer on the fog roof that had an ape on those like this, and that might have been good. Hold on. Hold the phone. Yes, I'm using a full restore. I have 45 freaking full restores, so I really need to not spam these things. I mean, like, really. Water Pulse is... Many people suggested it's a really good attack that I should have probably had on, like, on this thing the entire time. Okay. Well, it's a giant mirror match here. Anything. And I know I'm under-leveled on it, too. Seven levels under. Okay, this might actually work here. This might work. Um... That didn't look like it was doing too much, though, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, at the rate this looks, I'm definitely gonna have to cut her probably after I take this thing out, like, to go import this to my computer and then try this again here. We're cutting it close on the finale here. Oh my. I'll try a Psychic, I guess. Psychic, I'm, I'm gonna try and hit it with a Psychic here in the Lord's Special Defense. Thankfully, Shockwave can't amp actually get anything like Paralysis or anything like that. No, I didn't think that was gonna work. Fear me all you want, it's not gonna help you too much. Um, I'll try another Psychic, just cause I think that's before it'll get into Range of Village KO again. Okay then. Really, I could use this whole opportunity for healing up everything if I wanted to, but... Eh, I don't know. I think I'm going to take this opportunity just to finish this stupid thing off, and then... Or no, actually, I should take this opportunity to revive other things. Because Tokus... Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. This is going to be a big problem if I don't do something about this fast. Um... Okay, what do I have that's good? Um, Kulava for sure. I kind of wish I had max revives right now. Those would be really, really nice to have. I don't know how much PP Shockwave has. Padres who used to have it earlier on in the game, I think it did anyways. Yeah, it did, I'm pretty sure. Padre, so I'm gonna revive you. Ugh. I mean... Shockwave... Oh, whoops, did not mean to do that there. Um, next to the tripod up here. Alrighty then, gonna be... Wait, oh, shoot, um... HP restores, hyper potions, um... I guess I'll try and see how much, uh, Thunder will do, because I don't think it has anything that can always KO Pachirisu here. It would be funny if that Air Slash actually ended up missing, but I don't think that was quite possible there. Okay, Pachirisu, let's see what you got in this situation. Okay, I'd really like if this could paralyze, but Lord knows if that's gonna happen. Which it didn't, of course. I can probably take- I can certainly take an Aura Sphere, I'm pretty sure I can at least anyways. Oh yeah, definitely. And speaking of half HP, half what you have there. And next time, I- next turn I should be able to 
Wait, do I have Mammoth Swine left still? I'm not sure. I think Mammoth Swine. Oh, sweet. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Thunder. Yes. Thank you. Thank you very much. Very much indeed. Very, very much indeed. Very, 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 very no, I'm not going to do any more of that. Okay, Lucario, this is what I lost to last time. And it's going to be kind of a doozy to take out. Okay, Quava is what I'm going to need to use. And I'm going to have to use uh, Fire Blast at this point because it's not on full HP. Um. Yeah, okay, here's ex kind of what happened last time. Okay, Extreme Speed. Look at how much H- I- assuming this is good enough, look at how much HP this left me on. Yeah, and essentially that Fire Blast hit instead of missed. So, yeah, imagine what ended up happening last time. Mmm, I killed myself. On the 1 HP and the Life Orb affected me and killed me. And that's how I lost on my first attempt at this. I'm gonna flash that on screen because it was freaking hysterical, my reaction to it. <laughs> or if I well, survive this, come on, you have to survive this koala. You should be able to, please, please. Yes! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Wait, no! No! No, no, no! 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 Oh, man. Okay, I can certainly fire blast it again. It's using extreme speed a lot. Extreme speed, no, but it has... I have no minutes left left on this stupid thing. No minutes left left on this stupid thing. Come on, game! Okay, well, I have to, I'll be right back with uh, importing this stupid thing. So, small cut. I am back, everyone, right now. That was an awkward cut. Anyways, it's pretty much the end and downhill from here. I think if Cynthia only has two Pokemon left, that Kulava should be able to actually finish off with. Yeah, she. Wait, no, she still has Spear Tomb left as well, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she still has that stupid Spear Tomb left, because. <laughs> Hold on, because, yeah, she switched out at the beginning. Yeah, she does, okay. Um. Um. Hold on a minute. I'm just going to try this again here. Hope that uh, RNG doesn't get that high again, because, uh, 67 plus 67 is, uh, 144, I believe. Wait, no, that's... Technically five, but we're gonna get into that later. Of Pokemon Platinum. And at the beginning of this, I have to say that I have a guest with me. I am back, everyone, right now. That was an awkward cut. Anyways, it's pretty much the end and downhill from here. I think if Cynthia only has two Pokemon left, that Kulava should be able to actually finish off with. Yeah, she- wait, no, she still has Spear Tomb left as well, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she still has that stupid Spear Tomb left, because... <sighs> Hold on, because, yeah, she switched out at the beginning. Yeah, she does, okay. Um... Um... Hold on a minute. I'm just gonna try this again here. Hope that, uh, RNG doesn't get that high again, because, uh... 67 plus 67 is, uh, 144, I believe. Wait, no, that's, that's 134, actually, now that I think about it. I'm not sure, I cannot do math this time. All I'm saying is that I really pray that, really pray I outspeed because it's not using a first priority attack. Wow, that was convenient. That was really convenient! Oh yes! Thank you! Okay, now, I know what- Now, all I'm concerned about is the Spear Tomb. Spear Tomb is... 
probably gonna go down any second now, just because I'm gonna try Mammoth Swarm here. I know it, this thing's really powerful, but at that rate, so is Mammoth Swarm, and I can't see it being able to do that much to Mammoth Swarm, really, when you look at it, because Mammoth Swarm has a lot of power and defense behind it. You really can't deny that. Uh, let's see. Oh, wow, it was, a, it was able to take that pretty resistantly. Huh. Uh, then again, I don't know if this should be doing... Yeah, I thought I could have survived at least one of those. Okay. Well, this is a really, really close game. I have to admit that. Like, a really close battle. Because it's getting down to the nitty-gritty here, really. Especially down to the nitty-gritty here. Oh, man. Okay, Psychic again. I'm gonna Earthquake again. And it should be able to probably take it out this turn, actually. And I know what her last Pokemon is, and it's not really that threatening, because... Well, it was a Pokemon that gave us a lot of trouble earlier on, but that's because I didn't have the Pokemon that were good against it. As opposed to now, when I actually have the... My team members that are good against it. Mamoswine, Kalava... Togekiss, it really, I don't think, will be that bad. But, you never know, it could possibly hold a game changer, but I can't see it happening. I can't see this thing holding it not a huge game changer either. Because really, I don't, oh, oh crap, yeah, I'll, it's going to try and PP me out here. Oh crap, I just realized that. Dang it. I hate pressure a lot. Oh wait, oh my god, I just remembered one of this thing's moves. I'm surprised like hell it hasn't used it either. Oh, uh, this thing also has Embargo, which prevents you from using items for a set number of turns, meaning it can be very deadly if it decides to use that. And I should be able to finish it off here because it's low on HP. I can take this hit and the Ice Shard will certainly finish this off. Alright, let's go. Okay, you're gone now. Cynthia, you're down to your last Pokemon. Rose Raid. This is going to be officially over in a second. And I will explain why. I will explain as to why you do not stand a single bit of a chance compared to what I have left. I'm going to go down to my last Pokemon in a sec here, unless this gets a critical and finishes this off right, right now, but... Yeah, I didn't think it was going to do that. Okay. Here's why I'm going to be officially done. This thing's officially done. Okay. Pachirisu is going to be a death bot here. I want this... No, it's too fun to let this end. Yep, too bad. It's officially ending here. Not super hyper potion. Do you know what my last Pokemon is? You might be able to remember what my last Pokemon is. But my last Pokemon has a really, really overpowered attack on it. A really, really overpowered attack on a grass type. Quilava! Alright, Quilava, time to show what you do best. Do your do me one last thing and freaking erupt all over this thing! That's right! Let's Play Pokemon Platinum is over! Yes! This Let's Play is over. And... I hate to admit it. This was a Let's Play that... I'm not sure if I wanted it to be over or not. I really am not sure if I wanted this to be over or not.
I legitly could not have done this without my great team. And I have to say, I could not have done this without Dawn either. The names of these Pokemon will be recorded on here. And that is going to lead off towards this here. This is Bean, Let's Play Pokemon Platinum. Now before I sign off, I have to say a one last tribute. Also, I don't want to even mention how much I just, I love this song. I could listen to this all day. This has been the most triumphant Let's Play I have done, and I am happy to announce this Let's Play is over. I had a dream, and in the dream I met a girl, she wasn't ordinary, more so extraordinary. When I went to bed, I finished editing new LPs. Then to brush my teeth and go the hell to sleep. When I went to bed, I asked myself favorite LP. Looking on it was really tough. I decided to read a book. I skimmed through pages, looking at ads and ads, and then came across this one page. It had a girl on it much different than most other things I've seen. Her eyes were as blue as the great big sea, her hair brighter than the moon. She was the most beautiful thing I had ever seen. Looks like our time is coming sure. There is a stupid wall blocking us. Maybe someday we'll see ourselves again. I am not too sure, but the LP is coming. To an end. It's so sad to see you go. I wish I didn't have to leave you as so. Dawn, I love you.